before hosting the Conference on Sustainable Development Solutions for Rice Energy in Mecca Delta this afternoon. Prime Minister Nguyen Xuân Phúc has visited and worked with Lobjoy Group, a leading company in building the high-quality and safe rice production value chain in Mecca Delta. Lobjoy Group, formerly Indian Plant Protection John Stock Company, in the first private enterprise, building a rice production drain from research, transfer, and collaboration with farmers. The group has established the largest research center owned by a private company and has about 1,300 agriculture engineers who ate, live, and work together with 40,000 farmers to produce the organic, clean, and high-quality rice. The rice product of this company were recognized as one of the three best rice varieties in the world after the U.S. and Cambodia. Additionally, rice products for people with diabetes and high blood pressure were sold at a price of $14 per kilogram by Alibaba e-commerce group. At present, Lobja Group produces about 45,000 tons of seed rice each year and owns the first organic rice varieties in Vietnam. Prime Minister Nguyen Xuân Phúc praised the production model of Lobjoy Group and stated that this model needs the further research for replication because rice is a strategic product of Vietnam. However, it is difficult for Vietnam to have high yield and high quality rice varieties without science and technology, especially in such climate change conditions and only enterprises can apply the science and technology in agriculture, as well as take the initiative in rice variety. That is the weakest aspect of Vietnam. In particular, Dr. Group not only focuses on pilot production of new rice varieties, but also must improve the productivity at a larger scale. The Prime Minister Nguyen Xuân Phúc stated that Vietnam has the traditional agriculture, especially the Mekong Delta, with famous people in fields of scientific research and agriculture such as Professor Lung Nguyen Kuo. So is it worth thinking about why Vietnam loses to Cambodia? Therefore, Prime Minister hoped that the research results of Lok Joy and Yang will be expanded and popularized in Vietnam agriculture, especially rice production centers in Vietnam, including Mekong Deltas and northern regions. Prime Minister Nguyen Xuân Phúc suggested that Lobjoy Group must have more improvements in transferring science and technology to farmers in order that they can become rich and new bosses in the countryside, not only making a profit by their own work.